एज ग्रुप में जो बच्चों का कम्युनिकेशन एंड एक्सप्रेसिव स्किल्स जो डेवलप होते हैं उनको आप कैसे सपोर्ट करते हैं अभी आपने बताया कि जो वीक है थोड़े है ना जिनको ज़्यादा नीड है उनके साथ हमें खड़ा रहना पड़ता है ज़रूरी है खड़ा रहना तो उसी तरीके से जो डेवलपमेंट होता है इस एज में कम्युनिकेशन और स्किल्स एक्सप्रेसिव स्किल्स तो उनको कैसे आप सपोर्ट करते हैं कम्युनिकेशन एंड एक्सप्रेसिव लैंग्वेज इज वेरी वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट स्पेशली टू टू फाइव ईयर्स एज ग्रुप बिकॉज इस एज में बच्चे मैक्सिमम लैंग्वेज डेवलप भी करते हैं बिकॉज डिफरेंट बैकग्राउंड से भी आते कोई हिंदी कोई बंगाली कोई पंजाबी हमारी दिल्ली में जो स्पेशली माई एरिया में इंग्लिश है ऑल्सो बिकॉज ऑफन पेरेंट्स इज वेरी फैसिनेटेड दैट मे आई चाइल्ड शुड टॉक इन इंग्लिश ठीक है ना तो ये तीन चार लैंग्वेज में बच्चे ऑफन कंफ्यूज भी हो जाते हैं एंड पोस्ट पैंडेमिक में ये भी देखा जा गया बच्चे की लैंग्वेज डेवलपमेंट बिल्कुल नहीं है वो जो बोलना चाहते हैं पूरी की पूरी अपनी इशारा और हाथ की मूवमेंट और आपको कुछ ना कुछ करके समझा तो देते हैं एज अ टीचर आई अंडरस्टैंड ठीक है ना बट लैंग्वेज नहीं बोलते सो फॉर द लैंग्वेज डेवलपमेंट I my main thing I got which I emphasis is storytelling. Storytelling is a great great weapon. But like through storytelling you can give lot of words and child actually see if you tell a uh, suppose the tensed words they will not grasp the ten words. Come to a word every day agar aap bologe and ask the children can you come and share this story. So and continue also story. Sometimes you have to tell the half story, and then say, oh oh, oh I just forget the story. Can you take the props and other things, and then tell and continue from there. So children normally do like this from there. And story telling me voice modulation बहुत ज़्यादा ज़रूरी है. And props is very important. And another thing, your expression is very important. Otherwise, you cannot engage the small children. Second thing, small small instruction. Like, can you give me uh, this pen, please? I am not able to reach. Mm. So, moment the child give you the pen or pencil or something like this, then you should say thank you. And uh, also arrange the peer group play. Peer group play means uh, the two or three student. Okay, two children. They are playing together. Okay, let's play a doctor, doctor, doctor. I am very sick. I have a stomach ache. So this kind of acting, the role play, or the behind, or the peer uh, interacting through this, the child develops their language skill. And moreover, the for the nursery preschool rhymes, so is there. Rhymes is an another good thing to develop the language because moment you rhythmic the child understand a child learn the words very easily. जैसे आपने बताया peer interaction और peer group के साथ role play तो उसी से related अगर हम बात करें कि आप कुछ issues होते हैं उनको आप कैसे address करते हैं वो issues हो सकते हैं sharing, caring, cooperation, conflict resolution तो इन issues को आप पीयर एक ग्रुप्स में बोले या इंडिविजुअली कैसे एड्रेस करते हैं इस को दैट इज वेरी कॉमन थिंग इन प्ले स्कूल एंड आई थिंक इन इवन इन द फॉर्मल स्कूल आल्सो सी इन द प्ले स्कूल सपोज आई हैव 20 स्टूडेंट ओके और 30 स्टूडेंट सो वी कैन नॉट गिव 30 कार्ड और सेम 30 कार्ड और 30 सेम थिंग any toys so maybe five card is there or that maximum 10 card is there and most of the children is want to play with this especially the new toys if you if i had so automatically child started fighting ma'am ye to mujhe chahiye ma'am ye to mujhe chahiye maine first kiya tha so this is the at this moment you should play your role you have to apply your wisdom you have to apply that how you engage the child such a way where the child will not get hurt mentally and physically as well as they play together so moment suppose suppose i have two girls and there is a five children so i normally instruct like as like this okay let's make a circle And now run this car or the bus, whatever they like this. Okay, bye bye. This is the stop. Can you get down here? Now the bus will go to X X 
students. Suppose one of my students' name is X, and now that from there the girls will go to the Y. So all the children is involved, and they also that the previous question is that the language development, sharing, and care, caring. That is also, and I often uh, tell the children that sharing is caring. In my school, if you come, you can uh, see. Uh, but every student is said. Uh, oh, you don't know. Sharing is caring. So it's sometimes it's so cute, especially for the young children when they are saying this. And uh, another thing I normally do that is uh, when it is a break time, that uh, 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 breakfast time, that uh, it's, um, that time we open our table, everybody, and eat together. Though not every time they say uh, children with not sharing their foods or something, but sometimes somebody can bring some makhana or some uh, popcorn. So naturally chips, especially chips, which is not allowed in my school once in a any function or sometimes we I allowed chips especially. So makhana and popcorn is allowed. So uh, two or three children, can I have some makhana? So if the child said, no, I'm not going to share. So automatically I teach the children, sharing is caring, somebody is not sharing. So I am sad now. So child, the child is said, oh no, 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 I'm sharing, I'm sharing. How many do you want? So this is the things, this kind of activity. See, you cannot force anybody. Motivate karna is bohat zada zoriri hai. But kisi ko force karna, aap unse chin ke kisi ko de doge. That things the child will learn from the very early age. Chin ke lena chahiye. Rather than usko ye batao, sharing kiyo karna chahiye. Ye aapki friend hai, sharing karne se aap achcha bana hoge. Matlab sharing karna zoriri hai. Kyunki unko bhi man kar raha hai khane. Good feel, good feel. Yes. After sharing, how do you feel? Yes. What do you feel? Why do you feel? Yes. 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 Yes